The third of our addition reactions is hydrohalogenation. And this occurs when a hydrogen halide reacts with an alkene. So uh, let's have an example. We'll take propene again and let's react it with hydrogen chloride. The double bond breaks open and one of the carbons gets a hydrogen and the other carbon gets a chloride. But is that the only way to do it? Can you see another way that the atoms could add? If I draw this out again, would it not be possible that in fact the chlorine could add onto this carbon and the hydrogen onto this carbon? So in fact both uh, products are possible and this reaction gives two products and these two products as you can see are isomers. They have the same molecular formula but the chlorine is on a different carbon atom in each one so they have a different structure. Um, this one happens to be called 2-chloropropane and this one is 1-chloropropane. Alright, let's try another one of these. What if we had 2-butene plus, say, hydrogen bromide? Alright, what are our possible products? We could break open a double bond and we add our two new atoms. Let's put the hydrogen there and the bromide there. Okay. Our other possibility is that it adds the other way around with the bromine here and the hydrogen here. So, are these isomers? In fact, no, these are exactly the same product. Can you see that rotating this guy will give you this one? So, in fact, they're exactly the same molecule. So, this reaction, because of the symmetry of the original molecule, plane of symmetry down the middle. It has only one possible react, uh, one possible product, and the name of this product is 2-bromobutane. 